So we're back here with uh, Mastercraft Monday. It's an update for the few things that I've already done reviews on for these and my opinion obviously has changed on some and hasn't changed on the other. So we got the three things up on the bench here and we're gonna go through them and I'm gonna give you my 100% honest opinion on them and we'll go from there. So here is the drill bit set from Mastercraft that I reviewed. And I know I gave it a pretty good review last time, but now they're not very good. If uh, going through like aluminum, brass, wood, and mild steel, they're, they're actually pretty good drill bits. Go through anything hard or thick, you're going to be sharpening them a lot. And this case, I can't even tell you how many times I've dropped this stupid case. And as you can see, the mess about it, I just dropped it, say, a couple weeks ago. And I was tired of having to put them all back where they belong. So they're going to just get dumped right into my drill bit drawer so if you're gonna go buy these drill bits and you have any intention on drilling through thick metal harder metal I would not get them but if you're going through wood soft metals go right ahead go get them they're good they're good for that but I've sharpened these probably more time than I've actually used them and I've snapped a lot of them like the price on the set isn't bad I think on sale I paid 20 20 30 bucks so the price isn't bad but I'm gonna go get myself a nice nice drill bit set so there's that one I'll put that off to the side And the next thing that's up is this air chuck. It's supposed to have a clamp on there to hold it on. It doesn't hold it on. It leaks all the time. You still have to sit there and hold it on. I keep it around just for, because my other one that locks on, only starts at 10 psi this one starts at zero so for quad tires and that i'm able to put in five psi and be able to read it right so if you're thinking about getting this if you replace this end or this whole hose this part's still good gauge is junk i gotta replace the gauge gauge stopped working and I maybe have three hours, maybe four hours of use with this, and I can say it's complete junk. Just throw it behind me. So don't buy it. I think I spent 19 bucks on that. Don't. The next is my little 3 8 impact that I bought. And I think I paid $40 around there on sale. And I can tell you this, it is a wonderful tool. This little 3 8 impact has been great. I got nothing bad to say about this little 3 8 impact. It works amazing. It works every time that I need it to work. I've never, ever had an issue with it. If you're doing a lot of small engine stuff, working on quads and that, that you don't need a lot of a lot of torque with these little three eighths impacts are amazing so those are my views for what i've already reviewed and out of the three things this is the only thing that i would recommend buying so with that to say this was another mastercraft monday hope you guys have a good day